This is the first mass-produced Tukhiti bike to have a four-cylinder engine, and it's derived directly from the MotoGP bike's Bismo CDC V4, but with a displacement of 1103cc. Developed in very close collaboration with Tukhiti course technicians and riders, it steals directly from the race bike in terms of design and architecture, but still manages to deliver impressive service intervals of 7,500 miles, with the valve check only required every 15,000 miles. After spending five sessions on the 2018 Tukhiti Panigal V4S, we have these essential facts. The engine belts out 214 horsepower of peak power at 13,000 revolutions per minute and 123.6 newton meters of maximum torque at 10,000 revolutions per minute. Weighing in at just 195 kilograms, Panigal V4 has a power to weight ratio of 1.1 horsepower per kilogram, which is one of the best for the sports motorcycle segment. The spot on the racetrack is from 8,000 to 12,000 revolutions per minute. The torque is immediately available when exiting a corner. Torque is available throughout the power range, which will make the Panigal V4 an optimal street bike. It's tough for an engine producing 200 plus horsepower to not make loads of heat. Impressively, the V4 presenting no butt or thigh roasting on the racetrack. The heat remained minimal. Accessing and changing the settings for the suspension and electronics has never been easier. The settings aren't hidden deep in the menu. It is accomplished via a simple adjustment pad on the left control pod. All settings, save ABS, are switchable while on the go. The new Panigal V4 range debuts Brembo's new Stylema monoblock calipers, the latest evolution of the already high-performance M50. Machined from a single piece of alloy, they feature lighter weight areas in the fixing bushings and in the body, making them 70 grams lighter each, without compromising on rigidity. This is the most advanced Ducati ever built. A marriage of brutal power, electronics, and minimalism. Could this be the best sports bike of 2018?